For the first time in nine months, Nick Walczak laid eyes on the person who changed his life forever. It was in a courtroom. T.J. Lane is accused of killing three Chardon High School students and injuring three others, including Nick, who is now a paraplegic. Nick was surprised by what he saw in court. It was just not a very big deal. I thought I'd see a big bad teenager in there and it really wasn't. He just seemed, he seemed like a little kid to me. He's preparing himself for the trial and the one year anniversary around the corner and how Chardon High School will handle it. We're helping plan for it, like what we're going to do. Um, we're not really sure yet. A bullet grazed survivor Nate Mueller's head. He and Nick have become best friends, and while they lean on each other for support, they're grateful for the community. I think the one year is going to be crazy. I, I think it's going to bring a lot of stuff back up, a lot of the support again. But after a year goes by, and maybe people start to maybe move on a little bit more. Christmas time is Nick's favorite time. A gift from the Chardon Healing Fund is helping to pay for a wheelchair lift in his house. Meanwhile, Nick is more in the giving mood this year. Um, I'm trying not to let it mean anything different. I want it to be a normal Christmas. I don't even know if I want anything this year. I just might give presents. I, I have nothing to ask for. I've received everything that I've ever wanted in my life. The only thing he truly wants is independence, and today we helped him get a little closer to it. Nick, thanks to Monica, uh, hooking us up with many connections, um, you are going to have a service dog. Oh my gosh. Really? He's a golden retriever named Turner, and he should be ready in about nine months.